I have you and I ain't got no beef, no enemies. Call all my haters, motivators, cause they can't touch me. Been in this business for a minute, that's a long time. If you was looking for me, you can find me on my grind. I'm on a mission or competition for this rap king. The bet you think my crown and must have happened in your dreams. I'm about to make the world feel me like the greens you do. I line unleashed by catching from right here at the Green Thumb Garden Channel here in Grow Zone 8B, right here in Tipton, Georgia. And in today's video, YouTube, I want to bring you guys along with us over to the pumpkin patch where we're actually growing cucumbers. That's right, YouTube. We actually named a uh, section of our garden, Pritchard Garden Extended Grow Area, uh, right next to Sweet Baby Red, the pumpkin patch where we originally planted Big Max pumpkin seeds by Ferry Morris uh, approximately a month and a half ago. Those seeds did not germinate. I'm not sure what happened. Um, not saying anything bad about fairy moss, but those um, pumpkin seeds did not germinate here in our front yard garden extended grow area. We came back and we planted burpee cucumbers, actually the bush variety of cucumbers here at the pumpkin patch. And after we did that, we had one lonely pumpkin seed that actually germinated in that planter. So we currently have about 16 uh, cucumber plants over at the pumpkin patch along with one Big Mac's pumpkin plant that actually did germinate uh, about two weeks after we planted our burpee bush cucumbers over there at the uh, pumpkin patch. At any rate, YouTube, I'm going to flip this camera around for you guys and show you exactly what's going on over there at the pumpkin patch. Show you exactly what has happened since we brought you guys our last video update on the pumpkin patch which was during our full garden tour video here uh, about a week and a half or so ago. Um, we had two thunderstorms here um, since our last video, since our um, full garden tour video here at the Green Thumbs Gardening Channel. Um, that first thunderstorm actually dumped a ton of rain here at the Green Thumbs Gardening Channel. That second um, thunderstorm actually uh, produced about 10 minutes of hail that it actually shredded a lot of uh, the crops here in our garden, uh, YouTube, and a lot of those crops are actually beginning to uh, bounce back. When I spin this, when I uh, flip this camera around for you guys, I want to show you what's going on over there at the pumpkin patch, and you will see some of the damage that the um, hailstorm actually did to our um, cucumbers and our uh, one lonely pumpkin plant over there at the uh, pumpkin patch. But indeed, things are still looking well. Although, again, that hail did damage some of the leaves on our plants. That storm actually dumped a, dumped a bunch of rain here um, on our gardens um, after we had recently came through and fertilized out virtually everything in our entire uh, front yard garden extended grow area. So uh, that rain really uh, helped to soak that fertilizer in and everything had a huge uh, growth uh, spurt here in our front yard garden. At any rate, YouTube, I'm going to flip this camera around for you guys, walk you over there too the pumpkin patch and show you exactly what's going on with our burpee bush variety cucumbers and our one lonely Big Max pumpkin plant that did actually germinate a couple of weeks after we planted our cucumbers over there at the pumpkin patch. Hang tight YouTube. All right YouTube indeed here we are approaching the section of our front yard garden extended grow area that we named the pumpkin patch and YouTube, this is indeed what the pumpkin patch looks like today, May 28th, 2020, right here at the Green Thumb Garden Channel here in Grow Zone 8B, Tifton, Georgia. Take a look at this, YouTube. Bam. Take a look at how our burpee bush variety cucumbers that we did not trellis up are actually growing here at pumpkin at the pumpkin patch here in our front yard garden extended grow area youtube i tell you they're really a pretty pretty deep green they're really beginning to vine out here on um, they fully um fill up that planter and, and begin to spill out over the sides and I'll take you guys in for a close-up of this you can see there are blossoms everywhere YouTube there are blossoms everywhere on all of these plants here at the pumpkin patch our cucumber plants are virtually loaded with blossoms we did see a ton of honeybees out here earlier today when the Sun was out um, 
going from uh, plant to plant, pollinating our plants here at the uh, pumpkin patch. And we are hoping to see a few cucumbers here in a few weeks at the pumpkin patch. Also YouTube, also here at the pumpkin patch, here's our one lonely Big Max pumpkin plant that did actually germinate about two weeks after we came back and reseeded, after we came back and planted our um, cucumber plants here um, at the pumpkin patch. As you can see, some of the leaves look, look, look a little beat up, not only on our pumpkin plant, but on our cucumber plants as well. These are the areas where hail struck our plants and damaged the leaves, virtually shredding the leaves. <clears throat> Most of the leaves that you see that are not shredded up or damaged in some way are actually new growth. And the ones that you see that are damaged are the ones that actually got uh, damaged during the hail storm here. Same thing happened to a, a lot of the other plants in our front yard garden extended grow area. But again, YouTube, again, this is what, this is indeed what things are looking like with our burpee bush variety cucumbers and our one lonely Big Max pumpkin plant back there in the very back. Again, today is May 28th, 2020. And we will indeed bring you guys back within the next week or two weeks and show you exactly what our developing cucumbers on these plants look like at that time. Thanks for watching YouTube. And if indeed you are currently watching this video, you're not already subscribed to the Green Thumb Gardening Channel, please indeed take this moment to press that subscribe button beneath this video, that like button, that notification button, and be sure to share this video with your friends and family as well. Yeah. Growing burpee cucumbers and Big Max pumpkins at the pumpkin patch. Thanks for watching, YouTube. Ain't nothing here, yes, and I ain't got no beef, no hand in the leaves. Call all my haters, motivators, cause they can't touch me. Been in this business for a minute, that's a long time. If you was looking for me, you can find me on my grind. I'm on a mission, no competition for this rap king. To bet you took my crown, it must have happened in your dreams. I'm about to make the world feel me like the last time. So I make the microphones, but when I say what's on my mind, it was eight years ago when I first hit the rap scene. It was 2019, and I got the whole world listening. They gather around me to keep it warm for more than shit I bring. And I tell you some so why y'all Haters out there hating me. Why y'all hating? 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 Frankie Beverly and May. So I'm taking you back when rap was real in the old days. More than a man, I'm like a lion trying to expand. And the world against me, so I came up with a different plan. No more nine to five working for the other man. And don't trust the media, my destiny is in my hand. Then came a long way from where this lion first began. Won't let nobody make me hate the color of my skin. No matter where we're from, America is where we live. And I hear this and others, but I'ma tell it like it is. Everybody say they praying for some better days. But this world will never change until we stop the Hey, why y'all hate?